Lincoln Heights with more. Eric. Well, good morning. That meeting is scheduled for tomorrow night at a high school here in Arlington Heights. And the team really wants to give people here a, a good look at what they're planning here. It's not a done deal yet, but the Bears move from Soldier Field to Arlington Heights could be by next year. We're super excited. We've got young kids. Uh, we're excited to sign up on the uh, on the list to get season tickets and start taking them to games. If the offer to buy Arlington Park and the 326 acres it sits on goes as planned, the Bears would build a dome stadium in the northwest corner near Route 53 in Northwest Highway. It says it will pay for the stadium, but but will need financial help for the multi-purpose entertainment venue. A lot of this area is old and we need the, the revitalization, more money, more people, more new stuff makes it exciting to live here. I think it looks amazing. Drawings of what the Bears envision include restaurants, retail space, hotels, and office space. At least one group is actively lobbying the village board to stop any public money from being used for the project. Over and over again, we've seen stadium deals and corporate welfare projects turn south for taxpayers across Illinois. The Bears estimate if the sale goes through, the project would produce 48,000 jobs and close to 10,000 long-term jobs, translating into nearly $1.5 billion economic impact for Chicagoland, along with $16 million in tax revenue for Arlington Heights. Mayor Lightfoot at a press conference yesterday said the city has not given up on keeping the Bears in Chicago. We were going to make a very compelling case for them uh, to stay in the city of Chicago, and I think that we've done that. Um, and we're going to continue our discussions. We're going to continue our discussions, <coughs> excuse me, with the league. Um, but as you know, I'm some, somebody who likes to plan. So we've got plan B, plan C, um, and others um, in the works as well if the Bears decide that they're going to abandon the city of Chicago. I hope they don't, and we're going to keep fighting that fight uh, as long as we possibly can. Now, the Bears say they do plan to meet with village officials here at some point soon. We are live in Arlington Heights this morning. I'm Eric Ryan, WGN News. Chicago police are trying to look